Indonesia and Norway plan to launch a new pact to tackle the issue of deforestation in a bid to curb the effects of carbon emissions. Home to a third of the world's rainforests, Indonesia has lost a lot of forest land due to the expansion of crops like palm oil. And this is further threatening the endangered species as well as pushing indigenous people off their lands. Recently, the Southeast Asian country partnered with Norway to come up with a new agreement. The new Forest and Climate Partnership encompasses a results-based model where Indonesia sets the strategy and manages the funds. All this while Norway makes financial contributions for Indonesia's emission reductions. Simply put, Norway will, put, will pay Indonesia for years of deforestation reductions. Jakarta claims to have made progress by reducing the rate of primary forest loss for five straight years. And this is the reason why Oslo will now reward it with results-based contributions for cutting the emissions. The new agreement coming months after the collapse of a similar $1 billion agreement that was part of a UN-backed global initiative. It was struck down after being criticized for its ineffectiveness. Indonesia has an ambitious goal to reach a net carbon sink by 2030, but its vast forests are still shrinking. Global Forest Watch, a global monitoring program, has said the country's tree cover has decreased by 18% since 2000, and this accounts for 6.5% of the global total since that period. We are now available in your country. Download the app now. Get all the news on the move.